So I think I think it's only fair that we talk to our guest, uh, Tim Williams. Get one, one more round of applause for Tim. Thank you. Thank you so much. So uh, the Travago guy. That's yeah. the name you go by. Uh, do we have any? <laughs> sorry, right. I, I forgot to mention. We've got random Marnie. Is that? <laughs> Can we even see her? <laughs> <laughs> She's <laughs> got to check her connection. Okay, well, uh, I, I'm not sure um, if we have the slides. Oh. Oh. There we go. Yeah. Uh, random Marnie checking in. She's a random dog that we just keep on the video screen. That's a dog? Yeah, it's a dog. <laughs> <laughs> you can follow her at, at Marnie the dog. She has uh, how, how many followers? Over a million. Over a really? million. <laughs> Yeah. At Marnie. At Marnie the dog. Okay, Isn't I'll check that out. Isn't she super cute? <laughs> Shannon <laughs> loves Marnie. All she does is talk about Marnie the dog. I love Marnie so much. Marnie makes me the happiest. <laughs> is it a Shih Tzu? Is that a Shih Tzu? I don't care. I don't know. I just love her. <laughs> so do we have any images from the Travago commercial? Not to cut away from Marnie. We love Marnie, but... Uh, uh, you may have seen oh. this uh, familiar face late at night on TV. Um, uh, tell me, yeah, I'm, uh, I'm assuming you're just a working actor and you just got this random gig. Yeah. And then did you, was there any expectation that this would become a huge online? So I actually have some quotes uh, because this is a big sensation if you haven't, heard of the uh, online activity, uh, Slate said uh, that you are a sallow avatar of middle-aged masculinity. <laughs> this is all real. You can look this up. A found object in a cult item, an accidental enigma. <laughs> uh, Rolling Stone said that you are the rare pitchman capable of haunting your dreams while simultaneously inflaming your loins. <laughs> they did say that. And yeah. then finally, at the beginning of an 89-page message board thread, <laughs> uh, it begins with, I want the Trivago guy to pound my boy Gina mercilessly. <laughs> and this... This is just the tip of the iceberg for you. Yeah, yeah, it I'm is. sure when you got this gig, you didn't expect any of this to happen. Of course I did. Oh, you did? No, no. Is this no, a no, common no, 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 thing? No. People just... Uh... No, 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 no. We didn't, didn't have any clue that this would happen. It just came about, and uh, very surprisingly, in a good way. So mm -hmm. we're, all, we're all happy. So it's been positive? All positive on the, on, online? Yeah, even the negative's been positive. Well, what's the, <laughs> what's the negative stuff? Well, the 89-page thing you're talking about there, mm -hmm. that, that blog. Um, no, it's just fun all the way around to sit and read tweets and uh, anything that you guys are writing out there has been extraordinary and bring them on. It's been a lot of fun. So this is not your first brush with fame though. You were an actor before. You were mostly known from, correct me if I'm wrong, for a German soap opera? Correct, mm -hmm. correct, <laughs> correct. Hey, he's not lying. It's the truth. It was called Guten Zeiten Schlechte Zeiten. <laughs> And that's good times, bad times. You can times. Google that. Yeah, it's out there. It's out there. Unfortunately, you have to pay like one euro ninety nine cents to watch an episode. You know the reruns, but they're out there. And so, you, so you live most of the year. Uh, you, you grew up uh, in Texas, and correct. then you moved to Germany. Well, I moved to New York first, okay. and then uh, from New York to to Germany, mm -hmm. to Berlin. And what what what's kept you in uh, Berlin for so long? Hmm. Well, it's cheaper over there. There's uh, a lot of fun going on. It reminds me of yeah. New York back in the 80s. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, Murph was actually just in Germany. Uh, yeah. yeah. Red Light District, you know, hookers. Him and his wife uh, took a, a vacation yeah. there. Yeah. Yeah. I, don't remember, I don't remember exactly where I was. It's just kind of swirling lights. <laughs> <laughs> they have some fun stuff going over there in Germany. Yeah, right? a lot of fun. A lot of, lot of ups and downs, but it was... Uh, it's right up your alley, yeah, buddy. Yeah, it was right up... <laughs> Right my <laughs> I think I saw you the other night on television. Well, my my, my own private streams late at night. Yeah, it might have been <laughs> might have been Broad City. <laughs> um, are, do you do you kind of when you're when you're over there or when you're in New York visiting are, are you uh, are you a, a party animal? Because a lot of the thing it looked like uh, th they said that you looked like you were just like coming off of a hangover or something. You've just got uh, very casual. 
thing. I, right now, you seem very casual and comfortable. You're not like all the straight other pitchmen. <sighs> I'm nervous. I'm so nervous. It does not show. <laughs> this is guy's nervous right now. <laughs>